Car. Yeah, so uh, go ahead, Matt. Oh, this is Patrick Marsh. Uh, this is Matt Franks. <laughs> we are, we're from Frog. Yeah, uh, design consultancy based in uh, Ashley, San Francisco, and we have an office in Austin, Texas, which is where we're from. We, behind us, we built a full functioning 3D game using the Air framework from Adobe. And uh, it's pretty cool because we basically were trying to get this really immersive uh, gameplay that you, know, you would experience from playing and actually being in the game of Tron. Everybody's familiar with the movie. Two people on bicycles going you know, head to head, it's a death match. Uh, the object of the game is to stay alive longer than the other person. So don't hit any walls, don't hit any light ribbons, and you'll be good to go. Some of the technology behind the scenes, we used an old twin bicycle with a flywheel, and we hooked up uh, two different sensors. We originally used Arduino and uh, that microprocessor in order to get the um, speed and the steering data, but we recently, for Maker Faire, upgraded it to fidgets because it's a little bit more stable. We're using an optical encoder on the flywheel in order to get a really accurate uh, speed sensing. And then we also used um, a potentiometer, uh, well, it's a single uh, uh, spin encoder, for the uh, steering on both bikes. And uh, so far the gameplay's been even better with uh, the new fidget sensors that we've added yep. in. Yeah, it's been great. There are other ways to play the game, but nothing really beats the raw simplicity of being able to actually pedal to speed with the bike. Yep, there's something about that. I, I haven't seen a single person play this without breaking a sweat. And you know, that's, there's just something so gratifying about that, to see people getting on a, on a game and just going as hard as they possibly can and getting off of it, you know, out of breath sweating and having a good time.